Welcome to my channel. Learn English with Jasmine. Hi, friends. Today's topic is personal hygiene. Listen carefully and repeat after me. Personal hygiene means keeping our body clean and healthy. It is important because it helps us stay away from germs and diseases. Here are some ways to have good personal hygiene. First, we should take a shower every day. A shower helps clean our skin and makes us feel fresh. After a shower, we should always use clean towels. Next, we should wash our hands often. We must wash our hands before eating, after using the bathroom, and when they look dirty. Washing hands with soap and water helps kill germs. Brushing our teeth is also very important. We need to brush our teeth at least twice a day, once in the morning and once before bed. This helps keep our teeth clean and our breath fresh. Wearing clean clothes is another part of personal hygiene. We should change our clothes every day, especially after exercise or when we sweat. Finally, keeping our nails clean and short is important too. Dirty nails can have germs, and they can make us sick. In conclusion, personal hygiene helps us stay clean, healthy, and happy. It is easy to practice, and it makes us feel good every day. Now, repeat each sentence after me. Personal hygiene means keeping our body clean and healthy. Personal hygiene means keeping our body clean and healthy. It is important because it helps us stay away from germs and diseases. It is important because it helps us stay away from germs and diseases. Here are some ways to have good personal hygiene. Here are some ways to have good personal hygiene. First, we should take a shower every day. First, we should take a shower every day. A shower helps clean our skin and makes us feel fresh. A shower helps clean our skin and makes us feel fresh. After a shower, we should always use clean towels. After a shower, we should always use clean towels. Next, we should wash our hands often. Next, we should wash our hands often. We must wash our hands before eating, after using the bathroom, and when they look dirty. We must wash our hands before eating, after using the bathroom, and when they look dirty. Washing hands with soap and water helps kill germs.
Washing hands with soap and water helps kill germs. Brushing our teeth is also very important. Brushing our teeth is also very important. We need to brush our teeth at least twice a day, once in the morning and once before bed. We need to brush our teeth at least twice a day, once in the morning and once before bed. This helps keep our teeth clean and our breath fresh. This helps keep our teeth clean and our breath fresh. Wearing clean clothes is another part of personal hygiene. Wearing clean clothes is another part of personal hygiene. We should change our clothes every day, especially after exercise or when we sweat. We should change our clothes every day, especially after exercise or when we sweat. Finally, keeping our nails clean and short is important too. Finally, keeping our nails clean and short is important too. Dirty nails can have germs, and they can make us sick. Dirty nails can have germs, and they can make us sick. In conclusion, personal hygiene helps us stay clean, healthy, and happy. In conclusion, personal hygiene helps us stay clean, healthy, and happy. It is easy to practice, and it makes us feel good every day. It is easy to practice, and it makes us feel good every day. Now, it's time to practice your English. I will give some jumbled words and you have to arrange them, in a proper way, to make sentences. First question. From germs, stay, us, it, helps, away. Answer. It helps us stay away from germs. Second question. A. Every day we should take shower. Answer. We should take a shower every day. Third question. We hands often wash our should. Answer. We should wash our hands often. Fourth question. 
Important is very brushing teeth are. Answer. Brushing our teeth is very important. Fifth question. Nails have germs can dirty. Answer. Dirty nails can have germs. Now let's improve your English vocabulary. Having a good vocabulary makes you a better speaker in English. I will provide you synonyms of some words in the passage. Synonyms are words that have same meanings. Learn and memorize them. First, germs microbes. Germs microbes. Second, dirty filthy. Dirty filthy. Third, clothes garments. Clothes garments. Well done, learners. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Comment down below how many answers were you able to give. If you like the video, then please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. Comment and tell me what topic you want to practice next. Have a good day, everyone.